Over the past several weeks, you've had your fair share of aha uh -huh, or oh darn moments and other insights you've gained as you've explored how to create effective feed forward. These experiences are a key part of your deeper learning process that you can draw upon as you consolidate and share your reflections. The reflective practice is a fundamental component of assessment as learning and your personal and professional development. The transformational learning researcher Misero argued that you haven't fully learned something until you tell someone else about it. We want you to deepen your learning experience in this course and tell someone else about your learning experience through either a three to five minute self-assessment feed-forward video of your feed-forward strategy or a 10 minute exit interview or through a written reflection. The reason we are giving you these options is that we want to model flexibility and also want to model the importance of giving our learners full ownership and control over the the reflective process of their learning. We want to enable and empower you to not only find your voice, but use your voice to encourage others. Your reflection should address what worked, what you can do better, and what you may want to do next. Regardless of which reflection of learning format you choose, we know that this consolidation or aggregation of your thoughts on your learning experience will benefit you and many others. So we encourage you to embrace this opportunity to go deeper into your thoughts on learning than you may have gone before.